Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for S-Band Television! Hello, everybody. Hello, and welcome to Top Streamer Chapter 3. My name is S-Band, the finale of Top Streamer Chapter 3. Yes, so let's go ahead and have a seat and we are going to bring our next guest out for today. Used to be a really good hockey player, used to be in a relationship, ladies and gentlemen. NMP, LOL, NMP. Hello, yeah, great intro. Just had to hit all the soft, the soft spots there. Thank you, S-Man. Hello, I'm here. The finale of chapter three of yep. Top Streamer. Yep. Uh, the winner, the winner of chapter four is going to be receiving $50,000. Yes. And the remaining contestants are going to be getting their share of an additional $25,000, the runner-ups. Big, big, big prize money. Several weeks so far, eliminated many, many, many contestants. So, yep. Nick, are you excited about today? So, here's the deal. Today is going to be probably one of the most cringeworthy streams I think I've ever been a part of. It's gonna be something, it's gonna be hard for me to, to get through, but I'll be honest, you have the best job here, S-Fan. Oh, I love it. Yeah, you are, you are, yeah, this is this is gonna be rough. I love it. I'll be I'll be a part of some of the uh, some of the games too. Okay, yeah, we'll Maybe. see. Maybe, we'll see. We'll see if we make it through. I am, I am, I'm scared. Nick? Yeah. Go ahead and have a seat. Okay. Our next contestant for today comes all the way from Down Under, so don't ask her to break dance. T10 Nat. <laughs> Very good, very good, very good, very good. Did you like the break in? Yeah, it was good actually. That was really Olympic good. worthy. Yeah, very Olympic worthy. Olympic worthy. There's a, there's a lot that's Olympic worthy, to be honest. Sad or excited? Are you excited? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should make a fool of myself, really. I, I, I feel like this, this is uh, multiple times now that we've we've done introductions and you don't understand what I'm saying. Uh, no, I do. No, because when we're standing next to each other, you're kind of in another atmosphere above me and I can't hear you. Sorry? What? I, I said... I can't hear you majority of the time. Oh. I didn't actually think I'd get this far, to be honest, because I was like, just doing what like what I would normally do for streams. And I was like, oh, oh I, I made it through. Oh, nice. Well, that's good. Yeah. You did that, everybody. Very Yay! good. Very good. Go ahead and have a seat. Can I go sit over there now? Go ahead and have a seat. Oh, fantastic. Go ahead and have a seat. <laughs> go ahead and have a seat. Guys, next up, our next guest is a big man. He's not the biggest man that we've seen from Norway, but he is a big, big man. Arav is joining us. <laughs> Very good, Arav, good to have you here. Good to have you here. We are very excited to see you here. How do you, uh, how do you feel about your chances today? Thank you so much. I am a guy that takes nothing for granted, so I'm uh, I'm really thankful to be here. NMP has uh, pretty high hopes, it looks like. Yeah, I so, believe uh, in you, brother. With the with the look of his uh, face, looking yeah, good. I, I believe in you. You you got this, 100%. Yeah. Very good, Arav. Arav, everybody. Arav, go ahead and have a seat, and we are going to introduce our next guest for today. He's left-handed. He's adopted. Say hello to Seer. Oh no. Oh, and he's drunk. He woke up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Seer, how are you feeling about today? Incredible. Yeah. Very. Are, are you Are you excited? Are you confident? Yeah. I actually have a revealing some revealing news today. Okay. Go ahead. Everyone here is from all like Australia and different countries. Yeah. I'm actually a, a British actor who's been acting like an American streamer for some time, and so this is actually significantly challenging to oh. me. Seer is also going to be one of our uh, co-hosts for today, alongside Nick, uh, co-host, co-judges, I should say. Yeah, we're judging, we're not getting eliminated here. Yeah, so they we can have get eliminated. Lose. Very good, so, and in typical top streamer fashion, uh, we will make the contestants do things that we are not good at. Wait, um, so I have, like, diplomatic immunity, basically. Yeah, that, well, I mean, that's what happens. You know, when you, uh... Oh. Guys, so, uh, again, also with uh, Seer, we are doing the chat's choice of a character or something you'd like to see him do. Uh, so make sure to do that. So, Seer, thank you, Seer. Seer's gonna go ahead and have a seat. Our next guest was banned from the Screen Actors Guild. We couldn't afford Markiplier, so we went ahead and brought Sebi Webbs. <laughs> oh. 
All right, Sebi Webbs, good to see you. We're uh, we're very excited to have you here. Uh, you having made it to the very end of chapter three, how does that feel? It feels wild, mate. It feels very um, unexpected. Yeah. Uh, I'd, I'd say there's some confidence, yeah. But okay. I think improv is also pretty scary for anyone. So yeah, yeah it's, it's it's also gone. Do we have an audio issue? Music is too loud. Turn your speakers <clears throat> down. Thank you, Sebi Webbs. Some people love her. Some people hate her. Some people love to hate her. Some people hate to love her. It's Kedgy. Hi. Kedgy's Hi guys. here. Yeah, some of you guys hate me, some of you love me, but I'm here anyway. Kedgy, how do you feel about, uh, how do you feel about the, the show today? What do you think, uh, how do you think it's gonna go today? I have no idea. This is my first time doing improv in my whole life. So it's gonna be on the internet forever. So that's amazing for me. And I am regretting everything, every decision I've made in my life, but it's too late. It's catchy, everybody. Go ahead and have a seat. <laughs> very good. Very, very, very good. We are going to go over how the games are going to work. Uh, you guys are probably very familiar with this if you are uh, in my age demographic. But uh, today's games are going to be a series of improv games. And uh, chat, you guys are going to assign them some prompts. We have some stuff already written out and ready for them. They haven't seen it. Uh, they, they, uh, there's a lot of stuff they haven't seen yet, so they're going to have to improvise it on the spot. And they are going to be judged on their improbability and how entertaining they're able to make the scene. We are also going to have the progressive claim to fame. The next challenge is going to be if you can see if you can save on your car insurance at progressive.com. So huge shout out to progressive.com for uh, sponsoring the show, helping us put together Top Streamer because uh, Top Streamer could not happen without them. So huge, huge, huge shout out to Progressive. Check them out, progressive.com, and uh, see how much you can save on your car insurance because almost 100% chance that you can. We have our first game for today, the dating game. So TK, oh, Matt, Arab, and Seer, you guys are the contestants. So, so they're, we'll vying, they're vying for my love? Uh, yes. Okay. You are going to guess what their characters are. Would you care to? Oh. <laughs> Nat, what is your favorite food? Me, food. <laughs> what would you say? You're <laughs> hey, Rob, down. <laughs> okay. Water. Cavemen. Babies. Rob, what is your favorite food? <laughs> okay. What do you? What do you? What do you think everybody is? I think Rob's a dog. Okay. This guy has rabies. I'm not gonna date you. I'm gonna die soon. <laughs> I'm sorry. Or oh, he's dying. <laughs> a zombie? I don't know. Is that what it is? Fire. I, I don't and know because that's chat's choice. She's a, she's a caveman. She is a caveman. Siri, you have chat choice. What was it? I have been diagnosed with rabies. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay. Uh, Rob, you're gonna be looking for love. And then our contestants are going to be Sebi, uh, T10 Nat, and Nick. Whenever you're ready. Go ahead and uh, have at it. Here in Texas, and I'm kind of, I'm kind of wondering what mm. type of girls mm. are around here. Mm. Would you like to? Mm. If we were to go out, maybe on a dinner or something like that, is there something you would like? Oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't listening because uh, there's someone else in this room who looks rather fetching. <laughs> you know who you are. You, standing there all handsomely, oh, Giga Chad. With your brown jacket and your beige pants and your white sneakers. Oh my god. I t I'm sorry. Screw the show. I can't live a lie anymore. <laughs> it's you I want. Only you. Just, just, just. All right, all right. After the show. All right, text me. I have to work. Tell me. After the show. But the most fun I have is when I'm, you know, in the car with this German man, you know, this this strong German man who, you know, who's very kind to people and things like that, so. Okay, I think it's good. Okay, what do you think, uh, what is, uh, what, what do you think everybody's playing? Okay, you are playing as a person that is, uh, uh yeah, it's, ab it's, ab abducted. it's not TTS. Mm. Abducted. Yeah. Somewhat, yeah. Hmm? It was, yeah, getting tortured in a medieval dungeon for information. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. And I think Seb Webbs is just uh, a giga chat Seb Webbs uh, right there. Mm. So that's uh, I'm I'm sorry. This is uh, I, that that was good. Okay. So, but I I think you were uh, the Nick we all know. Mm. <laughs> that's it. Nick, Nick read your card for us. This is Chad's choice. Okay. 
So, wh who, who was I thinking about when I, when I was talking to you? Do you remember? Alpha. <laughs> Mr. Alpha. Mm. Yeah. So, that's it. Very good, everybody. Go ahead and take a seat. Woo! That was our first game. Uh, our, our first game for the day, the dating game. Great job, everybody. Uh, good job, S fan. Oh, well, you oh. I did fantastic. Thank you. Breaking news. So, breaking news is uh, breaking news is going to be a game where myself and Seer are the anchors. So, myself and Seer are going to be the anchors, and then each person is going to go up, and they will be giving a weather report or a news report over something that's happening behind a green screen. So, they cannot see what's behind them, and uh, we can. So, we are going to know what's happening. They won't, and myself and Seer are going to be giving them clues. Guys, welcome to the news. This is the 10 o'clock news at 6. And we're very excited to have you here. This is my co-host, Seer. Yeah. Nick, we've heard a lot about the festival going out there today. How's the festival? Uh, there's a lot of, a lot of oh, uh, people yeah. out there today. No, as you can see, we're having a lot of fun. You know, uh, the kids are having fun. Everyone's having a lot of I fun. I hope here. not. Everything is going super smooth here. Uh, yeah, you know. real smooth. I mean, people are just sliding around all over the place. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's mud. You know, it's just everyone's wet. Show and is are going you going to be joining as well after uh, the news today? You going to oh, be getting in there yourself? Yeah, I will be I'll be just jumping in head first, actually, face first. Good. Oh, um, that's straight good to into it, yeah. All the way to the bottom, lock it in. This is what I live for. I I, I don't even want to be on this, this, uh, this uh, newscast anymore. I just want to... Jump right into it and see what's going on, guys. All right, well, we're going to let you jump right into that. Nick, thank you for joining us. Uh, I think it was just a giant, like, mud mud pit wrestling. No, it was, uh, I mean, it might, it might, you know, it might have been. In but, Seattle? What was uh, it? It was, uh, it, it was a little soapy. In Seattle? 210 Nat, she's going to be joining us. Nat, do you hear us? Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of things going down here. Um, teacher and Nat uh, ready to report on what I need to. There's a lot of things going on back here. So we have a couple of people back here who are extremely upset here. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, honestly, doing like, you know, my left, right, good nights. Yeah, here. Those people, they look like they don't really want to talk much. Sorry, what did you say? I'm trying to, sorry, say uh, that again. They're, they're just all over you right now. Oof. Oh, God, yeah, no, I'm, I'm fighting for my life here. I, I would oh. say that eventually, after a few more get knocked out, oh. uh, I could have a conversation with them. I think their problem is, do you think it's the, the yeah. lack of hair or the lack of food? Um, I, I would say probably both. Uh, the lack of hair probably is pretty annoying for a lot of them. But get the F oh, off of oh. me! Um, uh, now, if you, there was one way that you could get rid of all of them, uh, how would you do it? Um, all together I'll put them into a truck and... <laughs> <laughs> All right. And I would drive the truck off a cliff. <laughs> okay. No, I mean, that, and that's, I mean, that sounds incredibly effective. Do you have any idea what's behind you right now? Uh, you said uh, barely any hair, food, and tantrums. So um, <laughs> after I started kicking them, I realized I done effed up. Was I <laughs> taking out like a preschool or, still, like, what was going on? Uh, these are crying babies. <laughs> <laughs> Great job, everybody. That was so good. So our next game for today, chat, our next game for today is going to be uh, a, 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 it's going to be a fun one. Scenes from a chat. Oh, God. Western Saloon. Uh, yes, sir. Listen, sir, is this your bar? No, it's it, it's uh, George Clooney's. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I just want to say, you know, since it's back in the you know 1600s, I really appreciate this quite diverse cast you let in your bar today. So thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate. It. I, they're yeah. letting people into this country still. Yeah. But yeah. anyways, that's aside the point. Oh. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh, do the oh, player. Diana, do the here. Get down on the floor. Oh, so oh, I'm a robber. This establishment. Oh, Donna, oh, 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 no. the oh. I don't know the here. I don't understand these actions. And how oh. about you, sir? Can I say one thing? She has about $10,000 on her. <laughs> oh, I'm coming to you, believe me. Okay, please take anything what else. What the hell kind of a bar do you run down here? I An American class. one. Not An American. American one. American. Oh, I smell American. someone who's not American right there. And you, sir. Hey. What I'm have just, you got I'm, in your pocket? I'm just a broke hermit. Braving the street? He, he is, Are you making fun of people who walk like hermit crabs? He is, uh, I'm, I'm, one, I'm one. You are you know, one? I saw three women down the street. They must have been some birds. Well, I do declare that is a mighty fine sentence. Missy from down under. You can't hide your accent oh, from me, by the way. I've been trying. Shoe. He's shoe. All right, I'll take one of them, too. Might go in with in that the best. Well, I learned this one from the Revolutionary War. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, no. Oh. 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 No. Oh, uh, the button. Oh, no. It backfired upon no. him, no. I do declare. Oh, don't take my foot. OK. Well, don't you look I like a silly keep, sausage. Keep, I do take declare. Oh. oh, no. Oh, no. The Norwegian backhand oh. chop, my only weakness. Oh, no. Uh, Have we learned CPR uh, yet? I do declare. Oh, no. 
Good job. Now rob him too. Get his money. Get his money. That's his uh, money. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good, very good, very good. <laughs> Excellent scene. Our next game for the day. Our next game is going to be called Caught. Our first round of this, we are going to have, we're going to have two detectives and a uh, criminal. Listen up, you jackwipe. Oh? We know what you did. Okay. Do you realize how many people you upset with your incompetence? I, I have no idea what, I am sorry. I didn't mean to. Um, uh, why, why am I here? What did I do? Jablonski. Just go, go ahead and say it. What? You were feeling a little angry. Jealous of his popularity, huh? Oh. How do you like this? Ah, Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is I'm abuse. the bad cop. Oh. Leave that. Oh my God. Okay, ow. My mom used to do that when I was a kid. Please don't do that again. That's, I'm sorry to hear that. However, that's besides the case. Yes, I, I'm a bit lost still. Is there any way? Were you always a horrible person ever since you became a doctor? <laughs> or was it the doctor who pulled out the bad man inside of you and you decided to get a little bit of wild because you love control and you hate animals. And you call yourself a medical professional. You like hating animals? Mm -hmm. What is it? What is it about a sicko like oh you that, that gets <laughs> life? Uh, killing a... Does that ring a bell? Oh, zoinks! I just lost my best friend. Yeah. I did not mean to, to, to kill Scooby-Doo. I was trying to save him. He had too many Scooby snacks. He was... Oh, so now you're lying to us. All right. Well, guess what? I got the White House on my mind. So either you can tell us exactly what happened, or you can go to Butt Boy Jail Central. I, I was right. I'd be okay and you'll with that. You'll be the Butt Boy, and I'm your cellmate. Oh, I'm also a part-time criminal. So <laughs> this has to be, has, has to be a conflict of interest. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> okay. no, I'm assuming you got it. What, what, uh, what do you think you're being? I'm a, a, I'm a doctor that, that killed Scooby Doo. There yeah. it is. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Very good. I didn't do anything. Are you sure about that? Listen, you don't know what it's like having a bad day at work. Mm. I didn't, listen, I have bad days at work, but I did nothing. Oh, but the three that you took out had a really bad day afterwards. I didn't take out anybody. Yeah, you did. How bad was their day afterwards? Really bad. During the nighttime, when you've done all your brews, you made all your beers, mm -hmm. you made all your uh, lasagna and stuff, and uh, you've been chopping, chopping logs, put them in. The lasagna yeah. and in you know that, scene. You know that one guy? That one guy on the on the table that is usually sitting there. Mm -hmm. Oh wow! You don't know who he is. Yeah. Huh? You're not gonna be happy where you're gonna be. Okay. Very. Where sweet. am I gonna be? Okay. In prison, mate. So we had all three. Yeah. I had a bad day at work. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I get a little angsty. Oh, well, in his entire group, no, they're all gone. Okay. Dead on the floor. And th th there is a third person that is missing. Okay. How many people did you say again? Yeah. A girl. That. Oh, I don't kill women. I Oh. oh! Did you just say that? Hey! Two male, one female. That third one, he, he was uh, waiting for a hair transplant, but it, he couldn't make it because you the, took him the out. The third one had, is said to have like a very big forehead that might, may or may not mm. have been an edited video. We do not know. Mm. Maybe I wanted to be a part of the whole shindig and I wasn't. I was never invited. This. Maybe I got a little That's bit it. jealous. I'm thinking. <laughs> okay. Did I murder steak and eggs? You yes. did, yeah, yes. he knows that. Yes. Oh, very good. We have uh, a voting. We have one final game before that. That is going to occur today for our last game of the evening, of the day. Yay! Elden Ring! Elden Ring! Elden Ring DLC. But before that, <laughs> scripted. For scripted, they're going to be acting out a scene. You have a key phrase, each person who's going to be in the uh, in the scene is going to have a key phrase and they're going to act out their scene and whenever they feel like it, they're going to pull out this card and they're going to read their phrase. A Rob is a newly hired maid who is attempting to ignore Seer's advances and Seer is the lord of an 18th century mansion. I love being wealthy. It feels so good. Uh, you know, I've been thinking about how you're here all the time and you but know Lord, what they yeah. Lord, it's only harvesting season. Yes. <laughs> but you know how when two individuals spend a lot of time together, it could be said that emotions get a little stirry. And oftentimes I could be in bed late at night, staring at the ceiling, unable to sleep. And I think one thing to myself every single night, this thong I'm wearing is really uncomfortable. <laughs> And I 
did not have sexual relations with that woman. <laughs> <laughs> Whether or not you did have sexual relations with that woman, or I was or was not wearing a thong, which happened to be quite tight. And I have one thing that I would absolutely love to say to you. I hear strange noises at night. And you do have mental issues, but so do I. It's okay because subscribe to MMP Law on YouTube. I love you. Oh, hey. If you say no, I will absolutely walk away from this. I am a, uh, I'm a girl, and, you know? <laughs> yes. I don't really, and I've been working here for a couple of years. I just don't really Absolutely. Think I, uh, it's okay. I'm okay. sorry I told you about the thong and I made you uncomfortable. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I just so I just had to play that one out for the first time. T10 Nat is Frankenstein, who is about to bring her monster to life. And then Nick is Igor, her hunchback henchman. Can I have Sebi pretend to be Frankenstein and just lay on the ground? Go ahead. Thanks, Sebi. Get in. All right. It's almost complete. Oh my god. I'll be able to bring him uh, back to life. Yes, yeah, so you did such a good stuff. job. But okay. if I inject him with some more um, strengthening hormones, I think he'll be, he'll be ready. Yes. If I just inject them, I think, let's get jiggy with it. Oh my, why is it wet? <laughs> Because I'm gonna get jiggy with it. That's why it's wet. Okay? <laughs> I can't wait. I'll, I'll help you. You will? S fan is one hot mama. Uh, really? Yeah. Lay a wet one on me, big guy. What? <laughs> oh, oh, you're back. Oh. It's fixed. Uh, wait. Oh my god, Matt. I feel so. I feel. Why are you dressed like a French maid? <laughs> because I'm. He, this is the first thing he's gonna see. And I know that he's gonna be into maids. Oh, he's arising! You did it! I've done it! He's waking up! Oh my god, wait. Oh my god! Uh, very good, very good. You, my bad. Great job, great job. Great job. Uh, this one is going to be um, for, uh, for Sebi and myself. You're gonna be a life coach. And these are yours. And then the, yeah, okay, good, 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 Gosh darn it, look at yourself. Look at your gosh darn self. Three week old ice cream bowl. No, no, dude, dude, I got that. Dude, no, listen, that was, see, I have two of them, actually. What, were you saving that for Christmas? No, one time it was a Christmas of 2003, actually. It was the year before World of Warcraft came out. No, no. Is that a rat? No, dude, that's, that's. In this Gene Willikers ice cream? No, that's Jeff. Let it me just, tell you something right Not here, you. Sonny Jim. I've seen a lot of things that, and people who need life coaching in my life, believe it or not. But it's times like this, my teacher once said to me, with cases like this, he looked me right in the eye and he said, there's a bun in my oven. Mm. And there was. Plain to read. Dude, dude, listen, dude. The, the problem is you get these buns and you go, I always used to go to this bun store. It was right down the street from my house. And then they went out of business. So there's the other bun store and it's a little bit farther away and I can't walk there. So whenever I go, they just it's not the same. If I can't walk there, I don't really want to. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. I have never heard so many excuses for the state of one's room, just look at it. Look, cameraman, look, look at this. Look at that. Look. This is atrocious. And you know what? You know what? I knew that you were trouble when I first logged into your stream for the first time. And as soon as you, I was watching you, you looked right in the camera and you said, do you want Chinese food tonight? <laughs> no, I, no, I mean, I, I mean, I, I see, I, I'm really... I mean, you weren't lying, because here it is. Well, yeah. From three months ago. But here's the problem. I, I ended up getting the Chinese food, dude, and, and whenever I, I took a bite and I didn't finish it because uh, I, I took a bite out of it and I immediately said, I can't believe it's not butter. I can't believe I it's wanted, not butter I either. Wanted, I wanted butter they don't use on my, butter I wanted in butter. Cooking. It's because it's time for my sponge bath. Well, that's that's also a thing that I do. So just hold still, hold still right there. Gosh darn it! If we're gonna clean things, if we're gonna clean up this room, we should start with the person who lives in it. <laughs> oh my God. All right. That was good. That was good. Super good. Super good. 
All right, excellent work, everybody. Excellent work, everybody. So, uh, guys, Seer and Nick are going to be leaving. All right, let's go leave. Yeah, you guys are excused. Uh, Seer and Nier are, <laughs> yep. are excused. Seer and Nick are excused to uh, privately score each contestant. Yep. Well, let me tell you guys, the, the results are in. And we do have our top two. And our top two will be going to the grand finals that's coming up. I don't know if we have that date announced yet. Do we? Or you will be boxing for victory <laughs> to the oh. death. Oh. I don't know. I don't want to leak it. What camera is it? Oh, okay. Which, which camera is it? I got the okay. End of October. End of October time will be the will be the grand finals. So the grand finals, the top streamer. Uh, chapters one, two, and three have occurred. This is the end of chapter three, and you guys will go on to the grand finals, including winners from the other seasons as well. Here at the end of the month, ish. So. Dramatic music. Really dramatic to, music is I really, playing. I really need a good bathroom, but you just like well, stole me. Let me do one dramatic pass. Mmm. Mmm. Right, right. Dramatic pass. Oh, no. Dramatic pass. Oh, no. So. Unfortunately. Sebi, you are going to be advancing to the finals. You are going to be advancing. Sebi will be advancing to the finals. Sebi will be advancing to the finals. He will be 100% advancing to the finals. Oh, good job. Again, chat, the finals. The grand finals are for a $50,000 grand prize and $25,000 in additional prizing for the remaining contestants. So, this is the big money. The big money comes at the end of the month, end of October. Yeah, so uh, yeah, we, we, have, we have some debates here, but uh, no, it is not a debate that, uh, that Sebi is, is, yes, he is advancing. Okay, don't get confused, that was a joke. Okay, it was a little debate. Um, <laughs> What is not a debate is that our next person to go through to the grand finals is going to be Arav. Arav, congratulations. Congratulations, Arav. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. How are the old dudes? Barry Crepe. Not creep. <laughs> Barry Crepe from chapter two will actually not be able to make it to the finale, and she advanced to the grand finals. And because of this, I don't feel like it's, oh. Nat is also going to, <laughs> to the grand finals. <laughs> so this is a last chance episode. There are two more spots available in the grand finals. And this one episode is a lifeline. It's a one last chance to be able to come back and make it into the grand finals. It's a lifeline, it's a last chance. So make sure you're there watching the callback episode uh, for a little bit. This is gonna happen at the end of the month. Oh and it is going to be for the grand prize of $50,000 and $25,000 of additional prizing. Yes. Woo! Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching today. Thank you guys so much for watching the show today. Uh, thanks to our contestants. Make sure to follow everybody. Watch everybody. Make sure to follow the streams. You guys All right. Up. Bye, chat. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye, chat. That was fun. Thank okay. you. Okay, so. Oh.